welcome back to my channel Virginia here with a new project for the wild hair kids um, I'm the guest signing for the wild hair kids this month um, so um, Alison Gillen the owner of the wild hair kids and their team put together um, a deluxe kit for me uh, based on my uh, profile and um, now I'm, I can work with this beautiful uh, kit uh, all over the month. Uh, I, if you want to know what was included in my kit you can watch the unboxing, uh, I will link it up here and also I've already shared a project that I created with this kit um, it was a layout so I will also link it there okay so this is a mini album um, which I collected just uh, or showcased just a few of the many pictures uh, that I shoot during my recent travel in California and uh, since it was a road trip I wanted the album itself to convey the idea of the, of the road trip so I decided to create a happy run mini album and I really really love it I think it's super cute and uh, I love how it turned out um, I used a cut file with the shape of the Ipivan of course and there are many out there available that you can buy and so you can choose the one that you like the most. Um, I used the cut file for the cover and I make it up with um, cardstock and pattern paper uh, while for the pages I uh, cut only the outline of the van. Um, by the way, I'm very sorry for the noise that you probably are hearing. The point is that uh, is, uh, there's a thunderstorm and it's uh, raining like hell in this moment, so uh, there's nothing I can do to avoid the noise. I'm really, really sorry. So let's move on. Um, I decorated the page. Uh, using uh, this beautiful uh, acrylic piece that says uh, adventure that was included in my kit I really really love it um, and I replaced uh, the windows of the van uh, with uh, a shaker pocket that I uh, filled uh, with uh, um, an exclusive mix of sequence by Spiegel Mom Scrap designed for the wild her kids and uh, I think it's really really beautiful and a very whimsical element and uh, I also like it that there are little hearts in this mix of the sequence and these are, um, are uh, alphas that actually these are from uh, the previous collection by uh, Schmel and uh, they were included in one uh, previous Wild Hair Kids that I ordered some months ago I bound the pages with metal rings and I put these ribbons, colorful ribbons, just to make it a little bit more beautiful. And so let's move on and flip through the pages. So on the back, on the back of the cover, first of all, I wrote all the itinerary of the road trip and I cut uh, the shape of uh, California out of one of the uh, pattern paper of the out and about collection by Bing Fresh Studio because my kit was full of products of the out and about collection by Bing Fresh Studio which I absolutely love. Um, and I added a few embellishments and this uh, puffy stickers from the same collection and uh, some uh, enamel dots so you will see that the album is full of uh, enamel dots <laughs> um, so the first page is quite uh, um, easy simple because i wanted to showcase that it's a beautiful uh, pattern paper with all these icons so there's just the picture of my pattern and myself in the airplane I'm doing in our flight uh, from Europe to California and uh, this is uh, a tag uh, included uh, in a packet of uh, tags uh, of the out and about collection then I have 
again a, a, a puffy stickers and this is a, um, one of the beautiful flirts included in my in my kit and I really really love it and again uh, there are a few enamel dots and uh, so let's move on the following page this is of course dedicated to San Francisco uh, and the Golden Gate uh, so I use uh, the um, these are not uh, were not included in the kit, I just bought at Michael's while I was there. Um, I bought a collection of dimensional stickers uh, about San Francisco in particular. And I really love them. Um, so I really like the back of this, um, of this pattern paper with all the same beautiful icons, white on grey. And this is in another of those uh, tags. Um, and uh, as you will see in all the tags I added uh, some uh, ribbon or better uh, some um, embroidery floss and some staples. So next page. Um, this is my favorite pattern paper of the whole collection of the out and about with this uh, rainbow and these uh, very bright colors. So uh, this is uh, of course about uh, Yosemite National Park and uh, um, as you can see I used uh, again one, uh, this is uh, um, a cut part from the cut part sheet um, and uh, I used a few icons, uh, these are cut out from one of the pattern papers. This again uh, you will see that in many pages I used uh, these uh, cute icons, they were uh, like stamps and I I cut them in squares and used as uh, embellishments and uh, um, I used uh, some foam tape to raise them up and give more uh, dimension. I also used a little bit of, uh, of thread here and uh, I think it's very cute. So next page, the back of this is also um, lovely. Uh, with the, all these uh, geo tag, this is very easy. Again, just a uh, um, couple of pictures, and as you can see, in I've, I've always created a few layers behind the uh, the picture. Uh, sometimes just with uh, uh, tissue paper, and other times uh, using pattern paper and maybe different layers. And uh, I used one of the dimensional embellishment included in the mixed embellishment pack of Out and About and uh, a couple of puffy stickers and again uh, animal dots. Uh, and this also um, a clip that was uh, included uh, in the kit. You have always uh, these uh, little glassy bags with uh, some items uh, that uh, some spare items uh, that uh, um, the girls at the uh, wider kit include in your kit. So let's move on to the next page. This uh, pattern paper actually uh, was from my stash because uh, um, I have a um, few pages here. I have already created uh, two more projects with this kit. Uh, so um, I needed a little bit more of pattern paper, so I used uh, something from my stash. But uh, the other elements and decorations are from the kit, not the alpha, because there was not uh, an alpha included in the kit, but I gave many, so I didn't explicitly ask for one. And so um, again, uh, we have uh, some layers behind the very photo, a tag, and uh, three of those. Uh, uh, elements and um, a lot of animal dots. I really love this uh, uh, this heart. This is an epoxy dot. There were there are a few epoxy dot in the dots in the same um, mixed embellishment pack of the Out and About collection. The back. This again is a very easy uh, page with just two big pictures. Uh, which I uh, backed them with uh, colorful um, cardstock or in pattern paper. Uh, a tag here, the, the whimsical cute element uh, which I added are these uh, pom poms. Uh, they are big and dimensional and uh, beautiful. I really, really love them and I bought them in a local craft store. Next page, um, for this I used a cardstock. 
but I wanted to, to add some, some dimension, some texture. Um, so I used uh, a stencil and uh, a glittery uh, paste to create uh, these uh, beautiful um, shapes uh, on, the, on the back. And it's really, really sparkly. Sparkling, I don't know if you can see it. I, I love it, I love the sparkling, I love the texture, I love uh, the shape. And this was inspired actually by the, the, the picture itself because it give, to me it gives a, a little bit the impression of the reflection of the sun on the water as, uh, as in these pictures. I, I used again a, a few puffy stickers and wool dots here as well. Um, this is one of my favorite pages for the um, design, the disposition of the elements. As you can see, in all throughout uh, all the album, I used a lot of these uh, blocky structures uh, with uh, rectangles uh, uh, positioned, uh, some house scattered around in some way. And this uh, I I particularly like with these two pictures and uh, another tag and um, a few of these other elements. And here, instead of using enamel dots, I decided to use uh, Nuvo Drops. I would say that I've started to use Nuvo Drop only recently, so I'm not an expert yet, and so probably they are too flat, I should have added a little bit more, but I'm, I'm learning. Um, and here again, I used uh, this beautiful pompon. I really, really love them. Uh, next page, this uh, pattern paper again is from the Out and About collection and I have these uh, blocky structures here at, as well with three photos and a, a couple of tags. Here I added one of the, uh, of the clips and also I have three, um, three beautiful epoxy dots. Um, and uh, uh, again, in most of the pages I always have um, the, uh, the repetition of elements in group of three. You can see uh, here three um, dots, three hearts, well, by chance, I have also three pictures. Uh, here, for example, I have uh, three of these icons, three um, pompon, uh, three places where I put uh, the, the enamel dots, and so on and so forth. I really like the repetition uh, of three of the same elements. The back of this page. It's very, very simple, again, it's just two big pictures. Uh, here, as you can see, picture of me in, uh, at Michael's, of course, I had to document it, because uh, as you might know, here in Europe, we don't have Michael's, so uh, anytime I go to uh, US, there are a few uh, shops where I love to go if I can, and of course, Michael's is one of them. Um, so I use uh, three of these elements, Gossi Du, and a few, a few other embellishments, and again the nouveau drops. Um, now, uh, this is the last page. Of course, as I said, um, there are many, many more uh, pictures uh, that I, I would like to document, and actually, uh, there are places uh, I went that are not included in this selection of pictures. But I didn't, it's already in bulk enough this album, and also it would take forever. So I decided to that I will just make a selection, and then when I have time, I will try to document the other pictures as well. So this is uh, the, the, my last page with uh, um, a picture of us in the uh, way back flight and as you can see we are very happy. <laughs> and not happy of living it but happy because the holidays were fantastic. And again here I have a, a, a blocky structure so with different uh, tags, uh, these uh, rectangles, uh, the uh, elements. And um, here I created just a, a little colorful element on top. So um, this is my last page and uh, 
Yes, I really hope that you liked this mini album. I'm very, very happy of how it turned out. I think it's very cute uh, and uh, and uh, chunky and colorful. I really, really love these vibrant colors of this uh, collection. I hope that you like it uh, as well and that you liked uh, this uh, flip through. If you have any question about the kit or about some technique in particular, please leave me a comment below and I will be more than happy to reply. Um, also, the, um, I would like to invite you to go check the um, Wilder Kit blog. There will be uh, pictures of these projects, but also the project of all the other ladies in the creative team. And you can try um, to fill in the uh, the profile is uh, is free so just you, you can have a look and maybe then you can order a deluxe or a empty kit and uh, see what happens so that's it uh, thank you very much for watching um, if you like this video please give me a thumb up and please consider subscribing to my channel thank you very much and I'll see you in my next video Bye!